newcomer to Nebraska, maybe even somebody from a different country and a different culture, what's the one important thing they need to know? About Nebraska, that, uh, hmm, that's a very good question. I gotta think about that a little bit. One thing. But what is a Nebraskan? What is a Nebraskan? Yeah. Wow. And what is a Nebraskan? Well, first of all, a Nebraskan is somebody who's come from somewhere else, including most of the indigenous populations. At one point or another, uh, they were somewhere else and came to Nebraska. I think it goes back to our ancestors deciding here's where they want to live because it's maybe a little bit isolated from everybody else and it's a community that they can grow and develop on their own and not have any influences from either, either coast. I think also a, a, a Nebraskan realizes that the basis for this state actually is the agriculture and the agricultural background. A typical Nebraskan you think of is as being you know, a farmer. You have these hardworking guys with the rough hands and bib overalls and they're always dirty because they've been out working all day and Nebraskans are just very hard-working honest loving type people that we're, we're people oriented we like people you know you let people know hey how you doing you're friendly you know I try to talk and say hi to people all the time you know and uh, it's just like in the country when you're driving through the country you know cars coming the other way in the highway everybody waves People don't do that in other places. It, it's like that in, in Nebraska. I just love it here. You know, the people are nice and everything. You know, my family's here. You know, I, there's no other place I'd rather be. If you got a question, don't, don't be scared to just ask someone. We're always willing to answer a question. We treat everybody nice. No matter whether you're from Cambodia or Iraq or whatever, we're gonna we're gonna welcome you and help you and treat you nice. You know, you're always welcome here. We love to have visitors. Uh, it's it's community. I think it, no matter where you come from, I think you're accept, accepted with open arms in the, in the city in the state. Nebraska is surprisingly diverse. This is a, a community made up of global populations, not local populations. And you can see that in my school too. It's really, there's like anywhere from like Indians to Irish. It's really cool. So it's a place that's been cosmopolitan in its populations uh, since it began and we continue to be. My great great grandfather come over here from Germany in 1852. We were brought here, you know, you know, so uh, I don't think we had too many, too much choice at that time, ancestors, but I guess we, we, you know, we made the best of it what we could. Well, I am a second generation American. My grandfather was from Denmark. Southern Scotland or Northern England. I'm a lot of things, really. Empire Germans uh, coming from Germany proper. My uh, African American. Luxembourg. Lithuania. Uh, mother's families were uh, Germans from Russia. Uh, Irish, <laughs> believe it or not. From Germany. A little bit of Sweden. From Ireland. Native American. A mix of uh, uh, Germans and Danes, mostly Germans. I like to say it's a little wok, a little stir fry, a little bit of everything thrown in. So. I'm half Swedish and then one fourth German, one eighth Scots Irish, one eighth Heinz. What I was taught as a child is that I'm Heinz 57. It means I'm a little bit of everything. So um, we can't say we belong to one specific thing. We're just kind of the Heinz 57. And that's kind of what the United States and Nebraska is too, most people. And so if what you want is a nice homogeneous place to live, Nebraska's not for you. A Nebraskan is somebody that takes a lot of pride in their state. The pride that comes with that is just that I know that I come from a solid, solid place. I'm proud of where, um, the way I was raised and, and also Husker football, right? Has anyone talked about that yet? Don't forget that. Well, we got the best football team, but other than that, uh... That might sound very shallow, but it isn't. You know, just a few things that really kind of stand out on the map if you ask people about Nebraska. 
And the thing is, is those are the few things, but they all are very successful and they're things you can be proud of. There are, uh, I guess what you'd call enclaves of Nebraskans in California and New York and Florida and everywhere you look and they come together because there is a commonality there. There's something that draws them together that is beyond the football game, but it's also in the way we were raised. It's in the traditions that we have uh, and hold close. My parents believe that um, you know, you do the right thing, and if you do the right thing, everything will turn out all right. They got good values. You know, like they're grown up with good values and everything. The, there's a sign when you come in the state that says Nebraska's the good life. There's something behind that. Uh, Nebraska is a wonderful place to be, and uh, uh, I, I work day in and day out to help people discover just exactly what that means. And I've been to some big places, and I've been around the country an awful lot, but it's just always nice to know that it's always nice to know when you get back, you're back. I've traveled the world, and it's always better to come home. It's, uh, it's the community, it's the, the people that are here, uh, uh, it's, it's how people are raised and how they treat other people. It's, I don't think you see that anywhere else but in Nebraska or even the Midwest. I, you know, I, I love Nebraska, but I, I, to say, well, what, how's Nebraska better than Kansans or, or Iowans? I, I don't know if I could specifically say we're better than, than anybody else. We're all the... Oh, well, of course Nebraska's special. It's far better than Kansas and the Dakotas just because it is. You know, there, there, there is a difference. A state that's unlike Kansas. <laughs> Probably the biggest difference between uh, Kansas and Nebraska is basketball. <laughs> Kansas has it and we don't. We're trying to get it. <laughs> uh, Nebraska is a place that, that brought its own mix of uh, economy and population and uh, cultural dynamic together uh, uh, into making it a very, very special place. It kind of depends on what you want to make of it, you know. Try not to tell the people on the East Coast that we're out here that we don't want them all out here. <laughs> anyway. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Good luck with your project. I appreciate it. Hope I can help you a little.